other news this noon, Hurricane Alex has just formed in the Atlantic. Meteorologist Troy Bridges is pinpointing it all for us. And Troy, this is the first hurricane in January since 1938. That's exactly right. It's moving closer to the Azores, certainly nowhere near us. We're going to keep you up to date on that. The big story for us is what's happening tomorrow morning, even late tonight. Clouds are streaming in across central Florida, all from this area of low pressure moving through the Gulf of Mexico. It will quickly move right into central Florida late tonight when you're watching Chief Meteorologist Tom Sorrells at 11 o'clock and then linger through the early morning hours tomorrow. But the risk for the strongest storms tomorrow will be from 7 in the morning to 1 in the afternoon. And here's what you can expect. The main risk will be strong winds up to 50 miles per hour or greater, even a couple of tornadoes possible. That won't be the main threat, but we can't rule it out. We're going to watch that very closely. We've rebounded from those cooler temperatures early this morning. We were in the 30s, 40s, and 50s. Now we're at 57, still in Ocala, 63 in Orlando, 63 at New Smyrna Beach. And you can see as we pinpoint your forecast through the day, we do warm near the average. The average high is 71. We're at 70 by 4 o'clock with that 10% chance for rain through the afternoon. Bridget, rain chances go up considerably again late tonight into tomorrow. And that risk of severe weather is the main concern. Of course, the very latest track on that hurricane coming up in just a little bit. Okay, we'll see you then, Troy.